Hey kids, you know, we all have families, every single one of us. And our families are our families. But everybody's family is different. We're going to be talking about our families so that all of us in our classroom community get to know us and a little bit about our families. All right, so I'm going to read you this book called A Family is a Family. All right, here we go. We were talking about families at school. The teacher asked us what we thought made our family special. I went last because I wasn't sure what to say. My family is not like everybody else's. Yeah, that's what the kid was thinking. And now different kids in the class are going to share about their family. Let's go to the next page. My mom and dad have been best friends since first grade. They really like each other. It's kind of gross. Oh my gosh, especially when they kiss in the restaurant. Oh my goodness. Oh yeah. Let's go to the next page. There are lots of kids in our family. Mom and dad just keep coming home with more. Oh yeah. This family looks cool with all those kids. Pretty gnarly. Both my moms are terrible singers and they both like to sing really loud. So this kid has two moms and they love singing. The hills are alive with the sound of music. All right, next page, next page. Here we go. I have more grandparents than anybody else I know. Oh my gosh. This kid's got a lot of grandparents. That's, uh, that's pretty cool, I would say. We have a new baby in our house. I think my mom ordered him online. Uh, no, kid, I don't think your mom ordered the baby online. I think uh, your mom got the baby. Either she gave birth to the baby or she adopted the baby. But both are her baby. All right, next page. We all look alike in my family. We just kind of go together. Oh my gosh, check that out. They're all riding a bicycle together. Pretty awesome. Let's go to the next page. Here we go. What does this page say? One week mom gets me. The next week dad does. Fair is fair. Oh, yeah, they take turns. I guess that kid's mom and dad don't live together. That's the case in some families. Some people say I look like my dad. And some people say I look like my mom. I think I look like myself. Yeah, I agree with you, kid. I think you look like yourself, too. Let's see what this next page says. My mom says that before I was born, I grew in her heart. Oh, that's kind of that's kind of sweet. All right, let's go to the next page. What does this page say? Because I live with my grandmother, people sometimes think that she's my mother. She's not. 
She's my everything. Oh man, that's pretty awesome. That kid lives with her grandmother, but her grandmother is her parent. Let's go to the next page. Let's see what this one says. All right. Some of the kids were dads when he met mom. Some were moms when she met dad. Now, we all belong to each other. Oh, yeah. They do. They're like one family. Even though some were moms and some were dads before the mom and dad met each other. Pretty sweet. I gotta say. One of my dads is tall and one is short. They both give good hugs. Ah, yeah. So this kid's got two dads and they both give really good hugs. Yeah, I miss hugs. I really do. This pandemic makes me miss them. Let's go to the next page. Oh, what does this page say? Let's see. I listened to everybody else. And then I remembered the time someone saw us all together at the park. She asked my foster mother to point out her real children. Oh, I don't have any imaginary children, Mom said. All my children are real. A foster mom or a foster parent is a real parent, is a real mom. A family is a family is a family. And check this out. All these kids, they drew pictures of their family. And each family is different, but that doesn't matter because all families, that's right, all families are tied together with love. So we're going to talk some more about families.